Jesus on this morning. Open up your mouth and say, yeah. If you're sold out for Jesus, say, yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord on this Pentecost Sunday. Maybe that's just a holiday for a few of us. But we celebrate Resurrection Sunday, and now we're in Pentecost season. The preacher told us on this morning that we will reap what we sow. And those of us that are celebrating Pentecost Sunday, we sow some prayers, we sow some fasting. I don't know about you, but I know it's my season. It's my season to be blessed. My season to restore it. Amen. I'm going to move on out the way. We are the Church of the Holy City. And we're broadcasting live here at our sanctuary located here at 4824 Davis Street in Emporia, Virginia, where our mission and vision is to reach lost souls for Christ. Our pastors and founders are our very own Bishop Nathaniel Dupree and First Lady Queen Dupree. We ask you to stay tuned until 1 p.m. or until the Spirit said let go. Amen. For good gospel singing, good gospel preaching, our speaker this afternoon will be our very own Elder Patrick Broadnax Sr. We thank God for the musical selection coming from our youth choir. I guess y'all get a name out the while. Y'all to give y'all a name out the while. Amen. They're singing the songs of Zion. Come on, celebrate our young people. Giving God the glory. Giving God the praise. Amen. The Bible said, train up a child the way that he or she should go. And when they grow older, they will not depart from it. Amen. We thank God for our children. We ask you to join in every Sunday morning from 8.30 a.m. Amen. To 9 a.m., our speaker, Elder Michael Whitehead, spoke this morning. Amen. Reminding us not to be well weary in our well-doing. Amen. Because it's reaping time. Amen. We ask you to join in every Sunday morning from 9.30 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. We have our Sunday school, which is the foundation, amen, of our understanding, learning more about Jesus and applying biblical principles to our everyday living. You can see our superintendent, Deacon Earl Wilson, Sr., for further details every Sunday from 9.30 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. Also, every Wednesday, we ask you to join in, come down to the sanctuary, or tune in live on Facebook, YouTube, or Twitter. We have one hour of power. Amen. Our bishop, our founder, brings forth a powerful message every Wednesday. If you can make it, tune in. It's nothing like that pick-me-up during the middle of the week. Every Wednesday, 12 noon to 1 p.m. Also, if you're interested in becoming a part of our online community, we ask you to call 434-594-4137, and that is between the hours of 5 p.m. and 9 p.m. Our bishop will be happy to give you further details. That is, if you're interested in becoming a part of our online community. Also, our corporate fast, we ask you to tune, uh, not tune in, but join in with our corporate fast every Tuesday night from midnight until 1 p.m. Amen. Jesus told us, amen, some things only come by fasting and praying. Amen. So it's nothing like fasting on one accord with our sisters and brothers in Christ from midnight to 1 p.m. Also, if you desire to sow seed into good soil, you can send that seed to the Church of the Holy Spirit. 
City, P.O. Box 175, Emporia, Virginia, 23847. Also, if you desire to sow Cash App, you can send that dollar sign, Holy City 68. Also, in addition, if you desire to come to the sanctuary, you can come between the times on Sundays from 8.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m., and someone will be here to receive your offering and tithes. We thank God for your liberal giving. We thank God for your tithes, your prayers, your offerings. It is because of your giving that we're able to keep ministry going throughout the uttermost parts of the earth, letting the world know that Jesus is soon to return, and he is the answer. Also, we ask you to come back, not here, but at 4 p.m., join our co-pastor. She will be the guest speaker at the Community Church of God in Christ in Druryville, Virginia. The pastor is Pastor Robert Joyner. We ask you to come in at 4 p.m. at May the 7th today at 4 p.m. You got enough time to get you a meal and jump on down 5th to 8th and meet us there. And those of you that can't tune in, we ask you, we solicit your prayers, amen, that God's spirit will go forth. Also, May the 14th, which is next Sunday, Mother's Day. Come on, mothers. Y'all get excited now. Y'all remind us every day that y'all are our mothers. Come on, get excited. We are honoring our very own mother, Helen Wilson, on next Sunday. Wave your hand, mother. If you don't know Mother Wilson, amen, that means you hit the door time church in because everybody knows Mother Wilson. We thank God for our beautiful mother. She gives, she supports, she serves, and wherever we need it, we call a text, even if we see in the store, we harass our mother, and we thank you for being the ear of support, for giving us medical advice. We thank you for giving us that sweet smile. We thank you. We love you. Come back next Sunday. And we're going to celebrate our beautiful mother, Helen Wilson. All right, I think that sums that up with our announcements. Our bishop has declared that this year is a better year. Anybody can testify that your year has been getting better? We're in the month of May, halfway through the year. God is still opening doors. God is still performing miracles. I don't know about you, but this is my season. Amen. So let us stand and read our creed collectively. This is a better year. My mind is transforming by the word of God. I am seeking God with all of my heart and drawing his presence near. What I think and believe is manifesting. I believe that I am healed. I believe that I am redeemed by the blood of Jesus. I believe my family is blessed. I believe that the works of my hands are blessed. I believe that every generational curse has been broken. I believe I have power to cast out devils, heal the sick, raise the dead, and share the gospel to those that are lost. I believe that when God calls me home, that I will reign with him in glory. For we declare and decree in Jesus' name, amen, amen. Our scripture that has been declared for this year, we're going to read it collectively. It's coming from 2 Chronicles, the 7th chapter, verses 13 and 14. Let's read this together. Ready? Begin. If I shut up heaven that there be no rain, or if I command the locusts to devour the land, or if I send pestilence among my people, if my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Amen. Put your hands together and shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. At this time, we're going to have our Be Led in Prayer by very own missionary Sandra Broadnax, followed by musical selections from our Holy City Youth Choir. And when you see our chairman deacon come up, it is offering time. After that, our speaker will be our very own Elder Patrick Broadnax Sr. Amen. In that order, let's receive missionary Broadnax at this time.
Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. First, I'd like to give it unto my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who is the head of my life, to the bishop, the first lady, the co-pastor, the mother, all the elders, saints, missionary, evangelists, and friends, and everybody in the sanctuary, and everybody who's listening. Let's go to the word, of, to the Lord in the word of prayer. Lord, whatever we need, God got it. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. First, Lord, we just want to give you all the honor, Lord Jesus. Lord, we want to give you all the praise, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, for watching over us last night, Lord, as we summon and slept, Lord Jesus. Lord, we thank and praise you, Lord, for touching our bodies this morning with your finger of love, Lord Jesus. Even us to get up to rise, Lord Jesus, one more time. Lord Jesus, even us to get up to see this brand new beautiful day that you have made, Lord. Lord, we just want to thank and praise you, Lord Jesus, for dying on Calvary Cross, Lord, for our sins and the world's sin. Lord Jesus, realize you didn't have to do it, but you did. Lord. And Lord Jesus, we are so thankful and grateful that you did. Lord Jesus, we just want to thank you, Lord Jesus, for our life, our health, and our strength. Lord Jesus, we just want to thank you, Lord, for the activity of our limbs, our sound, our speech, and our voice. Lord Jesus, we just want to thank you for all things and everything. Lord Jesus, realize that, Lord Jesus, it was that you that made us and not we ourselves, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we ask you to stop out this morning, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to walk up and down the aisles, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to touch right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, you know what we're standing in need of, Lord. Lord, we ask you to touch right now. Lord, we ask you to heal sick bodies, Lord. Lord Jesus, we ask you to save my soul, Lord. Right now, in the name of Jesus, come in the midst, Lord. Take full control, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we ask you, Lord Jesus, look down on, on the preacher today, Lord, who gonna bring forth the word, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, when he's standing before your throne and preach your word, Lord. Lord Jesus, let him preach your word from on high, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, help him to see nobody but you, Lord. Help him to hurt nobody but you, Lord Jesus. Lord, but feed us the word that you have given him to get at us, Lord. In the name of Jesus, have thine own way, Lord. Lord Jesus, we ask you, Lord Jesus, to look down on the ones in the hospital, Lord. The ones in the nursing home, Lord. The ones behind prison bars, Lord Jesus. Lord, let them know, Lord, they may be locked in, Lord, but they're not like that from giving your name to praise, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we ask you to look down on the young people today, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to bless them in a mighty special way, Lord. In the name of Jesus, have thine own way, Lord. Lord Jesus, look down on all the other churches, Lord. All the other auxiliaries, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to bless them too in a mighty special way, Lord. In the name of Jesus, have thine own way, Lord Jesus. Lord, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Lord Jesus, look down on the preacher, Lord Jesus. Look down on Bishop, Lord Jesus. Look down on the first lady, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to bless them, Lord, in a mighty special way, Lord. In the name of Jesus, have thine own way, Lord. Lord Jesus, right now, Lord Jesus, I ask you to look down on my family, Lord Jesus. Look down on my husband, family, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lord, bless us and keep us in a mighty special, Lord, in a mighty special way, Lord Jesus. In the name of Jesus, have your way, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We praise you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. It's the highest praise on this afternoon, Lord Jesus. Lord, we thank you. We praise you, Lord. We bless your name, Lord, because you is worthy to be praised. Lord, they ask you to look down on the bereavement family, Lord. Comfort them in the time of their lost ones, Lord. In the name of Jesus, have your way. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Look down on the ones in the White House, Lord, who's making decisions for our land and country, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, help them to get on one accord and make the right decision. Lord Jesus, bring love, peace, and joy in the land today. Lord Jesus, bring love, peace, and joy in somebody home, Lord. Lord, in the name of Jesus, have your way, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord, we thank you, Lord. We praise you, Lord, for all things and everything. In Jesus' name, we do pray. Amen, amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes.
Come on, come on, choir. to the missionaries, the deacons, saints, and friends, to the guests, amen. Come on, amen. Let the guests be a welcome on today, amen. Come on, somebody. Where you at, Holy City? Hallelujah. They could have been elsewhere, amen, but they decided to come over here in the vineyard and labor with us. 
Come on, let us feel welcome, amen. Ah, uh, yeah. Jesus, amen. Thank God, amen. For each one of you pressed their way out today, amen. Come on, Holy City. Give your own selves a hand of praise. Could have been at home making excuses. Your big toe hurt, your little toe swollen, amen. But you're here in the house of the Lord to praise the true and living God, amen. Woo! Thank you, Jesus, amen. I do give honor, amen, to the mother of the church, amen. Mother Helen Wilson, amen. Glory be to God, amen. Thank God, amen, for the ushers, amen. I thank God for my lovely wife, amen, with that prayer, amen. Glory be to God. Prayer is the key, and faith unlocks the door, amen. And you got to use it. If you don't use it, you will lose it, amen. Glory be to God. Thank God, amen, for the babies in the house today, amen. Hallelujah. I don't know about y'all, but I get joy when I see little ones, amen. Hallelujah. And this choir is singing. Lord, have mercy. I believe they done moved up another level, amen. Yeah, my body was tired early, amen, when they got to singing. Woo! My Lord, my Lord, I tell them sometimes, amen, to sing me a smile, amen. Glory be to God. I needed that encouragement today, amen. Thank God for Jesus, amen, amen. Glory be to God. You may take your seat in the house of the Lord. Ushers, you may take your seat, amen. God is good. Not sometime, but God is good is all the time, amen. Thank God for my mother-in-law in the house today, amen. My oldest son, Travis Terrell Broadnax in the house today. Thank God and my daughter, Tanisha, just came through the door. Glory be to God, amen. She may be late, but she just in time. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Everybody know who Pete. Oh, Pete up here, Minister Pete. Everybody know Pete, amen. Amen, the man of God, amen. The walking Bible, they had laid with him, amen. And I tell you what the truth, amen, I feel good. I, I don't know if I'm going to preach today. I just feel good, amen. I feel like jumping, south, leaping, skipping, hopping. Holy Ghost here, folks here. We Holy Ghost. Minister Timmy already said it's Pentecost Sunday. And, and we hold it. Every now and then.
return in your favor is turning around for you. Around for you. Around for you. It's turning around for you. Come on, give the Lord a hand of praise. Hallelujah. We just love the Lord. The book of John, the third chapter, verse 16 and 17. Sooner or later, turn in my favor. If you don't mind, if you can, stand for the reading of the word of God. It's turning around. The preacher said that this is his season to be blessed. Not only for him, but each and every one that believeth in Jesus Christ. This is your season to be blessed, to live and not die, to live, touch yourself and say to live, come on, come on, touch yourself deep and say to live and not die and declare the works of the Lord, amen. John 3, 16 and 17, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. For God sent not his son into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved. You may take your seats in the house of the Lord. My brothers and sisters, I want to speak to you for about nine to ten minutes, amen, from a topic when I didn't love myself. The true and living God loved me. When I didn't love myself, the true and living God loved me. What you saying, preacher? Amen. There was a time that we didn't love our own selves. Somebody saying, preacher, well, I always loved myself. I'm coming to tell you, you didn't love yourself. As if you did love yourself, you have been serving the Lord and not the devil. Oh, y'all don't hear me. And I had to say amen. I had to go back and put in the true and living God because there's many gods out here in the world today. I couldn't just say when I didn't love myself, the God loved me. I couldn't just say that. I didn't rest content in my sleep, amen. But I had to let you know that there is the true and living God. The God that created the heavens and the earth. That's the God that I'm talking about. I'm not talking about Buddha. I'm not talking about Muhammad. I'm not talking about the gold God. But the true and living God. The same God that breathed the breath of life into man. When I didn't love myself, the true and living God, Minister Pete, Evangelist Pete loved me. 
I'm going to prove it to you. No matter what happened or what you're doing or what you done done or what you're doing right now, God still loved you, 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 and everybody. For the scripture already and told us for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. God still loved us no matter what mess we was in. We was all towed up from the flow up. We were messed up from the crown of our head to the soles of our feet. We was messed up. We was a people on our way to hell. But Jesus Christ, the son of the living God, came down through 40 and two generations to save that which was lost. And we was lost. Some of y'all so holy and sanctified. Thank you. You've been saved all your life. You ain't lying to me, amen. You're lying to yourself, amen. We all falling short of the glory of God. Hey, glory be to God. We all came short. But when I didn't love myself, the true and living God loved me, amen. Let's move on, amen. Y'all got time to ride with me, amen, to Romans. Romans the fifth chapter, amen, five through 10 says, and hope make it not a shame because the love of God is shared abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost, which is given to us. I'm going to prove it to you that God loves us, amen. I got to read it, amen, from the book, amen, because, amen, so many people that's confusing, folks, amen, of the scriptures, amen, but I'm going to read it directly from the Bible, amen. For when we were yet without strength in due time, Christ died for the ungodly. That was you and I. Uh-huh. For scarcely for a righteous man will one die, yet preadventure for a good man, some will even dare to die. But God commended his love towards us that while we were that while we Oh, yeah. God bless you. That while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. Listen, y'all, y'all hear that? While we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. Ain't that love? Whew. Let me go on. Keep riding with me now. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. For if when we were enemies, we always was a friend of the Lord, amen, we were reconciled to God by the death of his son. Much more being reconciled, we shall be saved by his life. Y'all still riding? So drive on, preacher. Well, let's drive on to Ephesians 2, 1 through 5. And you have he quickened who were dead in trespasses and sins, wherein in time past, somebody shout, time past. Look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor, time past. Oh, they ain't hear you holler at them and tell them, in time past. In the lust no, let's go in. Wherein in time past ye walked according to the course of this world, yeah. according to the prince of the power of the air, All the right. spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience. Great. Among whom also we all had our conversation in time past. Y'all, wow. in time past. Work with. We talked about that in Sunday school. Y'all need to get to Sunday school. It's real good. In, in, in the lust of our flesh, fulfilling the desires of the flesh and of the mind. Yeah, you can sin in your mind too. And, and were by nature the children of wrath. Great. Even as others, but God, who is rich and merciful for his great love, wherewith he loved us. Great. Even when we were dead in sins, hath quickened us together with Christ. He by the it. grace, by grace, we are saved. Great. 
Y'all still riding? You got it. What well, can I tell y'all to put it in four wheel drive? Cause we about to get muddy. You got it. Jim. Let's go to First John four nine through ten. Says, and this was manifested the love of God towards us, because that God sent His only begotten Son into Work. the world that we might live through Him. Work with. Herein is love, not that we love God. What? He loved Not us. that we love God, but that he loved us uh, and sent his son to be the perpetuation for our sins. Work with. All right? Y'all got in that four-wheel drive, amen. You got real muddy, amen. With, it's amen. time now, amen, to get cleaned up, amen. Work Glory with. be to God. Let's ride on to uh, Revelation, amen. Get a little gas in us, amen, to get cleaned up. Revelation 1, 5, and 6 says, amen, and this is the conclusion of the whole matter. And from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness Great. and the first begotten of the dead Great. and the prince of the kings of the earth, Great. unto him that loved us, Great. unto him that loved us, uh and washed us from our sins Sin. in his own blood. Red and have made us, listen, Greg, nah. we done gassed up and got cleaned up. Now it's time to go on a ride. He had made us kings and priests unto God his Father. <laughs> to him be glory, <laughs> dominion <laughs> forever and ever. <laughs> and put a stamp of seal on it <laughs> and say amen. <laughs> when I didn't love myself, <laughs> the true and living God, <laughs> he loved me. <laughs> he loved me so much <laughs> that he came through 40 <laughs> and two generations. <laughs> to save me say yes say yes he loved me so much that he hung bled and died on Calvary cross for my sins and your sins say yes and give him praise when I didn't love myself God loved me the true and living God he loved me and I want to encourage you out there no matter what you in God still love you he love you while you in your sins he love you while you in the club he love you amen while you smoking dope doing crack cocaine he still love you but he don't love the sin that you're doing could God Almighty, I heard that if any man would come to God, that he'll clean you up, he'll sup with you, he'll be your God, and you'll be his people. Somebody say yes. Good God, I'm dying. When I didn't love myself, I was on my way to hell. Good God Almighty, running at breakneck speed, on my way to hell. But my Lord, and your Savior, uh, he loved me. Uh, say yes, uh, he loved you too. Uh, good God Almighty, uh, when I couldn't see my way, uh, God still loved me. Uh, he was right there uh, all the time. Uh, he loved me, uh, and I didn't love him. Uh, I served the devil, uh, and I want to let you know uh, that devil don't love you. Uh, if you don't know the Lord, uh, in the pardon of your sin, uh, hell will be your home. Uh, but it's your time now uh, to come out the world uh, and be ye separated. Uh, touch not uh, and handle not uh, no unclean thing. Uh, good God Almighty, uh, the Lord Jesus, uh, he's standing right there uh, at the door of your heart. Uh, he's knocking uh, at somebody's heart. Uh, saying, let me in. God Almighty uh, saying let me in. Uh, he's not the big bad wolf, uh, but I heard uh, he's the Alpha and the Omega, uh, the beginning and the end. Uh, he's the first and the last. Uh, he is uh, the great I am. Uh, he is uh, our Lord uh, and your Savior, uh, Jesus the Christ, uh, the Son uh, of the living God. Uh, when I didn't love myself, uh, he loved me. 
me. Say yes. He love you. You may be with God Almighty sitting now, but if you come to Jesus, he'll no wise cast you aside. He'll be right there when trouble all around. He'll keep you in the shadow of his wings. Say yes. He'll protect you when your enemies encamped all around you. Good God Almighty, I heard him say it. I'll prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemies. He'll anoint your head with oil. Say yes. Say yes. God Almighty, when I didn't love myself, the true and living God, he loved me, and I'm so glad that he loved me, he loved me so much, y'all don't hear me, yes sir, he snatched me out of the pits of hell, oh y'all don't hear me, I was on my way, you was on your way, but if you're on your way now, you can turn around and get on the right road, I heard. I heard the Bible said there is a way and a highway shall be there and it shall be the way of holiness is holiness of hell with the whole wide world say yeah say yeah you remember when you didn't love yourself and nobody else could God Almighty you remember when you was on your way to hell but Jesus stopped by and spoke to you and told you I said before you this day not yesterday not tomorrow but I said before you this day could God Almighty blessings of person, huh? life or death, huh? choose life, huh? you can choose life today, huh? you can come out the world, huh? it's a better life, huh? and serving the Lord, huh? you looking at somebody, huh? good God Almighty, huh? didn't have it all, huh? going for itself, huh? but when I got Jesus, huh? I became huh? royal, y'all, huh? I became huh? a holy nation, huh? stay when I didn't love myself, he loved me and he loved you. But you gotta step out, and when you step out, walk by faith and not by sight. I'm coming to Jesus just as I am. Yes, I'm guilty, I'm guilty to death. Good God Almighty, but the Bible declares that the wages of sin is death. But the gift, but the gift, the gift of God is eternal life. Good God Almighty, somebody's heart is being convicted now. If you only would step out by faith, good God Almighty, and serve the Lord. Yes, sir, he loves you. The devil telling you there's no hope for you. The devil telling you that you ain't going to make it, that you can't live saved, you can't live pure. You can't live a clean life. I want to serve notice and let the devil know that if I can do it, anybody can do it. If I can change, anybody can change. But I didn't do it on my own. It was the power. It was the power. The power of Jesus Christ, the anointed one, the savior of the whole world. Say yeah. It's time now to come out and serve the Lord. Come out of the world. Good God Almighty, you ain't got to continue living in sin. You can come out now. Say yes. Say yes. With somebody, get somebody else in their mind. Think about somebody that's on the streets or in your home and shout, come out. Sound like y'all don't want them to come out. Sound like y'all don't want them to come out. 
sound like y'all want to keep it to yourself. But we got to call them out of the world. We got to call them out of the hands of the enemy. Come out! Come out! In the name of Jesus. Uh, he oh, loved me uh, oh, and he loved you uh, oh, Lord. you, you and you uh, but you got to come out uh, come and be separated uh, from the world uh, right. there's a difference uh, Minister Pete uh, between holiness uh, and unholy uh, clean and unclean uh, there's a difference uh, between the spirit of truth uh, and the spirit of error uh, say yes uh, say yes uh, good God of my no matter what you've done or what you're doing right now, Jesus is standing, wanting you to come. He'll love you. Good God Almighty, even when people turn their backs on him, he still loved him. I heard him say, you may be a backslider, but he said, I'm married to you. My love, my love for you go deeper than any ocean. My love goes higher than any mountain. Say yes. Say yes. Do anybody want this love? The love of Jesus that shed it abroad to all, all people, to all kindreds, to all generations. Say yes. All nationalities, no matter what you're doing right now. Cinnamon, cinnamon, come on in Jesus and give your life to him. Say yes. Say yes. If you need a closer walk with him, you can come on to him. If you need him to save you, come on. Come on to Jesus. When I didn't love myself, you take that home with you. When I didn't love myself, the true and living God loved me. Jesus delivered me from a bunch of mess. I was a cigarette smoker but he delivered me. I was a weed smoker, but he delivered me. I was a wine drinker, but he delivered me. I was a cheater, but he delivered me. He is a deliverer. Whatever you is or are or will be, God will deliver you. But you got to make up your mind to come boldly. Boldly. You got to be bold and tell the devil no longer will I serve you. My mind is made up and my heart is fixed. I'm going to serve the Lord and God will give you that extra added strength that you need to stand. I didn't love myself. I didn't love church people. But look at God. Listen. The devil's job is to disencourage you. And tell you that folks don't love you. 
God don't love you, you're not loved, you'll never be loved because of your past life. But I'm here to tell you that the devil is telling you a lie. And the truth is not in him. There is a better way. There is a more excellent way of living. And that is to accept Jesus as your personal Savior. And Lord, will there be one willing to step out? Will there be one who are willing to make Jesus their Lord? If you are the one, you can come now. Glory. Never don't like it. Will there be another? You still got time. Come, come, come now. While the blood yet running warm in your veins. Whoever you may be, come now. While the table is spread the feast of the Lord is going on. Come on, choir, sing.
cast all your cares upon him. Come on, come on, let it go. Let depression go. Let it go. Let heartache go. Let it go.
you are free you are free to praise the true and living God yes stay focused keep your mind on Jesus yeah. when those bad habits want to come and try to attack you keep your mind on Jesus stay focused he'll see you through amen Turn to your seat. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. All right now. All right. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Come on, clap your hands for them. Come on, come on, come on. All right now. Come on. Another little soldier. Then join the band. It ain't gonna always be easy. But it's gonna be great when that trumpet sound. Amen? All right. Bishop Dupree. All right. You have anything to say? God bless you. No, I went overboard. All right. A.G. Another little soul done defeat the devil. Thank you, Elania. Thank you, Elania. Thank you, Artie. Another little angel done John the van. Beat the devil running. We glad that you had accepted Christ. If you know that you had accepted Jesus Christ, raise your hand. What a word that we have heard and received. Thank you, Elenia, for letting the Lord use you. The ones that came up to give God your heart, will you stand, please? Thank God. You know you gave Christ your heart and you have no doubt. You know that you are saved, that you accepted Christ in your life today. Raise your hand again. We thank you. We praise God for you. And we want to extend the church invitation to you. If you would like to become a part of this church, join this church, become a member of this church, you may step out. We'll give you the opportunity to step out. If you want to join this church today, we'll give you the opportunity. Or if you want to wait a while, you want to think about it. If you want to join the church today, you can step out. Or if you want to wait a while, you can stay right where you are. But the doors of the church is open right now. If you want to come, you can. Or will or may stay where you are. We thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Give them a great round of praise. Thank you. Thank you for being humble and obedient. God loves a humble, obedient person. We pray that God, Holy Spirit, will rest upon you, go with you, stand by you, and lead you all the way. Romans 10 and 9 say, 
if thou believe that Jesus died and rose again, thou shall be saved. With the mouth, confession is made. With the heart, man leaves unto righteousness. So you believe that he died and rose again and you are saved. May God continue to bless you. We thank you for coming. And this afternoon, we're going to be at Elder Robert Jr. Church. This afternoon, on... Um, down on 58, Church of God in Christ, Ella Robert Jr. Jonah is the pastor. What's the name of that road? Highway, South Hampshire Parkway, Highway 58. Our co-pastor will be bringing a message. And don't forget, don't forget next Sunday, what is next Sunday? We're going to celebrate Mother's Day. May God bless you. Brother Frederick Garrett, we're glad to see you today. You told me you were coming. We're glad to see you today. God is good. He's an awesome God. All right? We all need you. All right. Thank you. I'm going to give God some praise today, amen. Listen, listen, I, I want to say I ain't bragging, but I am bragging. Man, my choir sung today. I ain't bragging, but I am bragging. Sounds like they ready to take appointments. Thank God for Jesus, amen. I love y'all, amen, choir, amen. Thank God for y'all. Y'all really sung my soul happy today, amen. Amen. I mean, they sang it out, too. Woo. Made me want to join them. <laughs> Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for the musicians, amen. To each one of you who pressed that way out today, amen. God is so good, amen. I got to come up with that name. It was the, uh, Timmy told me I got to get a name for him, amen. Thank God for Jesus, amen. Thank God for the ones, amen, that came up, amen, to give their life to Jesus Christ, amen. 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 You won't regret that decision, amen. I can guarantee you. It might get rocky at the first, but they're going to level out after a while. Come on, stand to your feet and we're going to go to the house, amen. Hope y'all follow us down 58, amen. They used to call it suicide script, amen, but we're going to church. We're going to life. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Know the co-pastor got some word of life in okay, amen. And we're going to hear the word of God, amen. With uplifting hands, let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be accepted in thy sight. O oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer, in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Go in peace, everyone. I love y'all.